Aloha everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Noelle and I do unboxings here. Mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, and even a dash of Disney. So if you like unboxings, I do hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. And if you're already subscribed, thanks so much for being here and welcome. Today I've got something a little bit different for you in case you couldn't already tell by the title. It's just a little box swap with my dear friend Lucia over at Laughing Without an Accent. If you haven't checked out her YouTube unboxing channel, definitely Definitely check it out as well as her Instagram account. She gets so many different boxes, you guys, and often she's got great promo codes to share with you as well. So sometimes I get great ideas from her and we just talk to each other almost every single day, offering each other some support and encouragement and advice. And she's been really helpful as I've started this YouTube journey, like almost right from the beginning. Basically, we get so much stuff, you guys, that there's no way that we can use every single item. So we kind of stockpile things, and a lot of the times we put little bundles together to do giveaways. But even then, sometimes I find things in boxes where there's no overlap, where we don't both get the box, where I just want to earmark it for Lucia because I know it's something that she'll enjoy. So we just kind of collect a little box of things for one another, and then when those boxes are full, we go ahead and send them. Even though she actually just lives up the coast from me, we haven't ever met in person. Hopefully one of these days we'll be able to make that happen, and we'll probably like do a live or something and share that with you guys. But um, I was very excited because she did such a great job even decorating the package. It's this little like button and she used some of her like planner supplies because she does a lot of like planner unboxing stuff too um, and it like almost all the washi tape had fallen off the back so when my mail carrier handed it to me it looked like there were like streamers like trailing the package mine was a very plain plain box so I apologize Lucia I was not I did not get crafty with your packaging but inside I just kind of cracked it open and it looks like she like wrapped every little item up. I did not do that either. Everything is just thrown in the box. But I'm very excited to show you what I've got and maybe you guys can even help me. Sometimes I can't keep track of all of her different unboxings that she does. But it is kind of fun to see if I recognize some of the items from those different videos. So the first thing I am seeing is some whipped peppermint body butter from Heart and Soul. Nice size. She actually put it in a little, little baggie which was nice. I like like, um peppermint body butter for my feet because it's like a nice foot cream um, and it is great even in the summer because it is kind of refreshing I'm gonna go at a pretty quick clip because it looks like this package is super full I've got a little jewelry bag here and let's see what we've got we've got some cute little stickers I think these are from um, maybe they're coasters no I think they're stickers I think these are from tree line time and these are like little like New York emblems which I I love I was on the one train not the seven but I'll still take it I think that's kind of cute and then we've also got a little bag with a little pineapple design she actually sent me like a bigger version of this too and it does say live a pineapple life and it's got that quote you know stand tall be sweet on the inside and I'm not really sure it's got like a little carabiner on it and then it's just like this little pouch but I guess you could just like put extra stuff in it that you need to um, I'm not sure really sure but maybe like Oh, I think it goes with that bag. I think this is supposed to go on the outside of that like little reusable bag. So she's just send, sending me the follow up piece. She must have found that later on. Cool. Now I've got some more tissue paper. It's really fun. I'm like looking inside and there's all these like, different colors of tissue paper. So she, as usual, has given me way more stuff than I gave to her because she spoils me that way. This is cute. And some of you guys know that I'm a crazy cat lady that doesn't have cats. It's a little trinket dish and it's in black with gold edging and it just says meow. So I'm gonna have to go thank her, right meow. Um, I love that, that is adorable. I love trinket dishes. If I had a cat, I would um, give it treats and that, but I, I, I love black cats. I think they're really cute, as well as those like blue gray cats. Those are my favorite. Then we've got a um, Maui Soap Company loofah soap. This has been pretty popular in a lot of subscription boxes lately, and this is in the scent of hibiscus. So I think we got one of those in single swag. I think I got one of them in a uh, Hugo box, but I have not gotten a hibiscus one. So I'm like collecting all of the different fragrances, which is fun. And of course, it's fun that it's uh, Maui Soap Company. The next thing is in yellow. 
and it's another heart and soul item. It's a sugar scrub, and this one is in coconut and lime, which sounds like an awesome, refreshing, summery scent. So that's kind of fun. We got two things from the same company. I do like doing like skincare stuff in the same like product line. Next is from Molten Brown. It's a coastal cypress and sea fennel bath and shower gel, and it's in a really pretty bottle. And I do like shower gels. I definitely use those, but that sounds good, and it probably smells really good too. Yep, nice, fresh, coastal scent. Totally something that's right up my alley, something that I would have totally picked out for myself. I uh, got something in a little glamour jewelry uh, container, so let's see what this is. This is cute. It's like a little um, koozie that's like knitted with a little octopus on it. That's adorable. So you put this around your coffee cup so that you don't burn yourself, but that's really sweet. I'm guessing that's from Kieran and Hari, but it's not, not the box that I got, so that's cool. Um, this is cute. This is funny. So it's this little um, like trucker hat and it says Aloha on it and it's got a gold pineapple. I like the teal. I actually gave these same hats away to uh, my friends at my bachelorette party. Even though it was in Mexico, I still, the wedding was in Hawaii, so I gave everybody these Aloha hats. So we were totally those annoying bachelorette party people with matching matching party supplies. Um, but of course, she also knows that I love pineapples and I am from Hawaii, so that's why she gave it to me. I'll have to like see what I can do to un unsquish that. Sometimes those don't like to come back from being squished. Um, it's because you can't like iron the foamy part in the front. And I've got something else here. Opening this guy up, maybe. So as some of you guys know from like my Q&A, I try to keep all of my videos under 20 minutes and like these box swaps with Lucia are like <laughs> some of the videos where I have to just, just keep going at a quick clip where I know I'll never ever be able to get through all of it. So this is just a nice little like stationary bundle, which is exciting. It looks like we've got a bunch of little like note cards that are just like positivity cards, daily dose of kindness actually on the back. It's got little like to and from, so you can just hand these out to people or tuck them into like cards, which I think is a sweet sentiment. And then we've got this little like gratitude. This is a cute notepad. So you could definitely use it for your schedule, but you can also use it as a little like gratitude journal. And I like that because I like notepads. I try to be pretty organized. And then we also got this little notebook, got a little bent on the corner, but that's okay. And it says women with vision start as girls with dreams. And then it's nice, it's got a little pocket on the ins back inside cover, and then it is lined, but it is like college ruled, so I like that. I don't like it when it's the big fat lines. I don't know why. I have really like minuscule handwriting though, and that's probably why. Um, really, I should like wide ruled pages because then it gives that teeny tiny writing a little bit more breathing room. And then some of you guys know that I get way too much tea. She gets a ton of tea subscriptions too. So I was like, please don't send me tea. Just don't send me any tea. Um, but she sent me some coffee, which is awesome. So we got this broadcast coffee, Johnson House Blend in a little, little container. And it looks like this is a single serve bag that you can just do with filtered water. So you can do like a cold brew situation. And then I got two single serve pour over coffees, um, Columbium Calca. And it says tasting notes, orange, caramel, and brown sugar. So that's cool, two of those. So some of you guys know, I've said it a bunch of times before, but I usually use a Keurig for my morning coffee, but you, we do have those like reusable pods so you can use ground coffee and try that out, which is actually better for the environment anyway. Um, so I should definitely do that more often, but I do like having coffee. Usually when I'm traveling, I like to have those single serving coffees so that I can make coffee even while I'm away from home. And then finally, we've got one more thing. I'm so glad I made it through that whole bag in like not too long because I don't want you guys to have to just sit through me getting presents. It's like when you're at like a birthday present and then a <laughs> birthday present when you're at a birthday party and then it's like time to open the presents and you just have to sit there and watch the person get all of these amazing things or like a wedding shower or a baby shower. And sometimes I'm like, I'm happy for them. But at the same time, I'm like, I don't need to be here when you open the presents. Like we're not six. I don't need to be here for that. 
but I wanted to share with you guys. And then plus, if you guys see anything that you really like in here or that you have any experience with, you can tell me in the comments below. And we can always play that fun guessing game of what box it came from. And then Lucia can probably chime in and tell us exactly where they're from. <laughs> all right, and then this is all wrapped up. I do like the unwrapping part. Next time we do a box swap, I'll have to actually individually wrap her stuff too. So this is a candle, and you guys know that I love candles. It says currently unbothered, and it says sea salt and sage. That sounds awesome. So it's just in this simple little jar. It's a soy candle. Let's see what it smells like. Probably sea salt and sage. It actually smells like sweeter than I was expecting, but like not in that like cloying sweet scent. Cause like sometimes when we get into fall, we get awesome candles, but sometimes they're like too sugary, too sweet for me. This is nice though. I feel like I'm not sure what's, I'm not sure what the sweet part is because sea salt and sage sounds like more fresh and herbal obviously, but I do like this candle. So I'm very happy to have that. And as some of you know, my husband loves candles too. He is so awesome. You guys, he often uh, does most of the cleaning in the house. I know that's crazy, right? But then we always like to like burn candles to make the house smell less like cleaning supplies and more like whatever candle. So I always let him pick out whatever candle from our candle drawer that he wants to burn. Um, love this i think he'll like this one also so thank you lucia for spoiling me and it's like such a good assortment it's always kind of fun to see like how your friends would like curate a lifestyle box obviously like this box would be like you know a 200 dollars box which most of us don't have to like throw out a subscription box but great items and i'm happy to just kind of do that kind of swapping things so that we get things that we'll use and things don't go to waste um pretty excited about the candle i'm excited about like actually that body scrub of course i love the loofah soap from maui and even this body wash it smelled so good you guys i think this is my favorite thing weirdly weird for me to have body wash this is my favorite thing let me know what you guys thought let me know if you'd like to see more box swaps or maybe we can even do it with other channels so get more people involved and other than that you guys i hope you have a fantastic day if you like this video please do give it a thumbs up i'd really appreciate it or if you just appreciate the channel give this video a thumbs up and hopefully i'll see you all very very soon in my next proper unboxing